So we went to the Renaissance Fair. Is this the first ever? No. So they actually had one the year before, but we couldn't go because we had just gotten back from Disneyland. Okay. And we were pooped. And the crummy thing is we were kind of pooped this week, this time that we went too, so we didn't stay very long. We literally went an hour before it closed. Right. Yeah, I bought like two things. I bought a pen that's shaped like a sword. It's really <laughs> cool, actually. And I love that it's like the really skinny uh, gel pen nib that I like. Uh-huh. Um, and then I also got one of those little uh, belly dancer uh, scarves because I think they're super cute. And it had lots of jingly little coins and it seemed fun. <laughs> <laughs> if you have people in your family that are into that sort of thing. And if not, you know what? If you want to introduce them into a little bit of like lightness, fantasy, and... Uh, LARPing. Yeah, and LARPing. <laughs> Take them on down. Well, yeah. I guess this next week it won't be there, but last week was the last weekend of it. Right. So there, was it two weeks long? Three. It three? It was three mm-hmm. weeks long? I know, right? Okay. But they had the vendors. They had the merch. I saw a buddy of mine on Facebook got a dwarf axe. Oh, cool. They had a, like, put your own weapons together booth. Oh, that's cool. But yeah, I have to yeah, say- we I, didn't see hardly anything. We were so in and out. They had the merch. They had the vendors. You know, they had all mm-hmm. sorts of, like, jewelry and art. Yeah, and, and little shows. Right, little mm-hmm. shows. Here's some knights knocking each other out. <laughs> We'll try to be a little bit more ahead of that next year. And, and spend a little more time there. Yeah, remind you about it. I didn't even have time to, to put together a proper costume. Oh, yeah. What would you have been? I probably would have gone as a fairy. I actually went looking for fairy <laughs> wings, but I couldn't find any. Fairy. Yeah. Well, okay. When I was a kid, I played Titania in um, Midsummer Night's Dream in like seventh grade. Right. And my aunt had these really rad fairy wings that went down the back of your costume. So they looked more realistic. And I, I even called her up and I was like, hey, do you still have have those and she's like yeah but they're buried there's no way i'm getting them getting them out today and i was like well snap <laughs> so i wish i would have called sooner and gotten something together but you know i just wore some close enough that i was like all right this is fine <laughs> i do love the fact that we have a renaissance fair here me too well i mean technically in rexburg yeah, well but, you, I know, mean, you know it's kind here. of in rigby yeah kind of like halfway yeah close enough great place for it you know right, you right. kind of feel like you're out in the in the, the forest. forest a little bit. <laughs> yeah. Have to avoid Mon- the fey. <laughs> yeah, right. Uh, Ammon Farmers, or sorry, Idaho Falls Farmers Market in Ammon. Let's go back to that for just a second. Oh, yeah. We want to show you this config. So here I am at the corner. It's basically like an L. Mm-hmm. It's just two streets mm-hmm. at a 90 degree angle. And it's honestly, it was because we both live on the east side. Yeah, it's really convenient. So it was so nice and convenient. And sometimes, yeah, you Mm -hmm. would rather go on a weeknight, in this case, Wednesday nights through August, Mm -hmm. than, you know, take up some, a block of time on a Saturday. We specifically went there just to get dinner. Yeah. You know? Yep. (laughs) And it was perfect for that, especially because then, you know, if you guys are both feeling something different, you can go to two different booths. We thankfully weren't. We just went to the same. Uh, We actually went to that um, Sabor de Mi Corazón. The taco truck? Yes. It was pretty good. You had those keto tacos. Uh Uh-huh. And you had the carne asada fries like you do. I love carne asada fries. If it's on the menu, Carly will get it. They're just good. But the keto tacos were kind of fun. The taco shell was just cheese. Yeah, which I love cheese. Yeah. Like, honestly, I was a little jealous of yours, but Mm -hmm. like not enough to trade because mine was really good. Also, their habanero salsa. Yeah. Delightful. Great. Delightful. I wish I could have um, taken a little extra home with me. Honestly, it was so good. So thanks, Ammon, for hosting that. You know, there really is only, I don't want to say one thing in Ammon. Ammon has plenty. Sure. They've got half of what's on hit. Yeah, right. (laughs) They've got McCowan Park and they do everything there. And Ammon Days is coming up. We'll probably talk it up. I'm so excited for that. Next episode. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because it's August 2nd and 3rd. (laughs) But it's not this weekend, but next Right. I want to say. And we really want to try to make it to the balloon lighting thing that they do on a Friday night. Okay. You know how entangled Rapunzel like always wants to go to see the floating lights? Yeah. That's kind of how I feel about that. 